everyone. You are here at school today and I am at the beach. Oops, sorry, I wasn't supposed to tell you. All right, except I was, so whatever. All right, so I just wanted to tell you about your assignment today. I told block three, but I didn't tell block one or two. So your assignment for today is first go to Canvas, as you know, always you should do for me and probably everyone go to Canvas. Go to science, obviously and your assignment is posted in the announcements right here okay and it says here is a slide with your assignments for today so just click on the slide and then it says for you to do first your ecosystems vocabulary mastery connect if you haven't done so and i linked the to do slides right there so all you have to do is just go there to the correct block. That's key. Go to the correct block. So block 1B day. This many people have not finished the Ecosystems Vocabulary Mastery Connect as of Wednesday during block 4. And I should be able to update it between now and then if you get it done during advisory today. All right, get that done. Don't take too long because I've left you a bunch of work to do. All right, and then when you're finished, then you should go to the to the rest to the terrestrial ecosystem canvas. It's in your assignments, but I linked it up here for you on the slide. And just a quick overview of what you should be doing. Um, you can open the research links slides if you like, but you don't actually have to because if you link up down below and open that up then I have linked up for you on the actual worksheet where the, the slides. So you can just click on Rainforest, right? Go to Rainforest. The first thing on the um, document is describe and look. Oops, description. Now do not copy and paste. I will obviously be able to tell since I'm the ones that gave, that gave you the uh, article. And I don't think you even can copy and paste because it's an image that I put on there. So you're going to have to, which you should anyway, write about it from your own words. So read the text and then go back and describe the tropical rainforest. All right, I want a nice description in each box. Um, the next one is for plants of the uh, tropical rainforest. And I want you to put in pictures and label the pictures. So I gave you an article right here that has lots and lots of rainforest plants. Just copy and paste your pictures right into the box. And underneath the pictures, you would want to label them. Um, if you get into trouble, let me show you real quick. Let's say you pick this rubber tree. I'm going to copy the image of the rubber tree. And I'm going to go up to the document. And I'm going to put this in. Then... As long as you put it in, okay, yeah, label first or else enter a couple of enters. That way, if a lot of times people have trouble writing because they put the next picture in and then it's hard to scoot the words in between the pictures. So just make sure after you enter, after you put the picture in, enter it a couple times. And then, of course, label like this rubber with two Bs and a rubber tree. All right, so add your pictures and label. You need to do three animals and look woo, right up here. I've got the animals. There's an article with lots of pictures of animals that you can label. Then I have a link to a climate document, which you're going to have to reinterpret into your own words. Again, it's an image, so you can't even copy and paste it. <laughs> I'm so brilliant. All right. And then the last one is so easy. It says location on Earth. And for this is the only one you can copy and paste. You can just copy and paste the map in there. But I did want you to be aware of the places in the world where you see the tropical rainforest, always obviously clearly in the tropics, in between the Tropic of Cancer and the Tropic of Capricorn is where the tropical rainforests are. So just copy and paste that image in. If you have trouble doing it from there, then just use the link to get the image. Copy image, copy image address, copy image. There we go. Let's get the old brain working. Go to the terrestrial ecosystem and then just throw it right in there and where in the world. 
So I'm totally fine with you just throwing in a map there. And then you're just going to complete this. And once you're done, then if you get done, then you have a second one to begin working on. And where's the slide right here? Yeah, there's an aquatic ecosystem, one that you can work on exactly the same idea, the exact same principle and do the same thing. So I'll just open it up and let you get a look at it. The ecosystems that are there for aquatic are pond and lake, salt marsh, estuary, shallow marine slash coral reef, and deep water marine. All right, and that's about it. You got the same information, the same kind of links. And with that being said, I will stop. I hope you have a good day and be good to your sub, and I hope you have a great weekend. Bye.